Good morning Capricorn and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm having a little fun because the energies have been so heavy, so serious lately. I want to share with you what I shared with Sagittarius. Um, I put something pretty interesting on my answering machine in case my ex tried to return. And I put on there, Hi. You have reached 1888-NO-MO-HO. Please press 1 if you're a returning ho. Please press 2 if you have a fake-ass apology to make. And please press 3 if you'd like to schedule an appointment with me. <laughs> Otherwise, please stay on the line and one of our agents will be happy to serve you. I just, uh, Capricorn, I just, uh, I literally started sobbing. I was laughing so loud. <laughs> the tears were coming out of my face. And that's the approach I'm taking. I'm going to face it. Oh, wake up call. We better not <laughs> go to answering machine. But um, I'm deciding to take it with a sense of humor and uh, realize, you know, I'm not spending any more of my energy being um, sad. You know, the, the way I feel is that I've given this individual enough of my energy and I wish not to give it any more of my attention or my energy. So this is my way of coping. I get a pretty distorted sense of humor sometimes. So I hope it doesn't offend anybody because that's not my intention. But I am going to title the video that because of the energies that have been so heavy. And I'm it's done to bring a little humor into your day. So let's see what... Uh, is Capricorn going to do? What are the messages for Capricorn concerning us? Bear with me. I have a twisted sense of humor. Um, Capricorns are getting finances. Their finances are astounding, and uh, I've been saying for days about the blessings, but it's to do with wish fulfillment. Yeah, I can't shake it. This person that owes you an apology, the selfish one, <laughs> they can press two because they want to make a fake-ass apology. Um, the two of cups is here. They love you, but they're still at a crossroads. They don't know really which direction to take. Uh, they're stuck, but they want to tell you the truth about their options. Well, press three, schedule an appointment. What do they want to tell? Capricorn about this apology. Yeah, they, 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 they were out being a player, that it burdened them. These third parties became a burden to them. Uh, that they faced their shadow and that they know that they wounded you and no doubt they were wounded. But they want to come in and present some kind of uh, take things slow mentality. But they're presenting that their offer is stable. Yeah, they don't like the distance between you. And that they received their karma. What do they want to say to Capricorn? They want a commitment with you, but they don't express themselves. That they love you, but they're lonely. And yep, expect it. They want to reach out like as a friend. They want to take control. 
because they know you're financially stable and you're getting some type yeah they would like to have passion with you passionate new beginning with you yeah capricorn you can't make this up they see your coin they see your stability they see they could have something long term with you they want to act on their passions Things have ended because of that. They acted on their passions. Oh, but, and the choice in lovers that they had. They see you as the empress energy, nurturing, caring. They want to put in the hard working and they're stressed out for the leap. They want to take a leap of faith. They knew you were the true love of their life. The nurturer, the caregiver, and they've been heartbroken and that they would like, this is a page of pentacles. This is a tiny little pentacle that they can offer you. And high priest is here to stand in the midst of all of this as above, so below. They have probably received their karma and now they want to come rushing back in. This is an impulsive energy. They do things whimsically, like they really don't put a lot of thought into it. They just come because they're impulsive. They're still in this indecisive energy, but they want to offer, come in and offer equal reciprocity. And no doubt they still could be giving to two. But they're having fond memories of you because they know you're the catch. <laughs> These people need to learn that number. I'm telling you right now, they're something else. They're egotistical and arrogant. And they see Capricorn's financial stability and they're like, wow. <laughs> Yeah, they want to offer to take things, smooth things out and move forward. Uh, that they've had a realization. They see the truth now, but they're still indecisive. Yep, they want to make you a love offer. Because they see that you're single and abundant and looking good, smelling good, feeling good. And now they're sad and remorseful how things ended. And they're still controlling and manipulating. They've been watching you, keeping an eye on you now. This either could be through social media, friends of friends. Like what's Cappy been up to? What's Capricorn doing? They see you very passionate and beautiful. They know you are and that they betrayed you. They're still juggling. They betrayed you because of juggling. And it created so much drama about where they're at. They're going through it. Trust me. And uh, now they want to move forward toward Capricorn. Capricorn's advice is to use their intuition to hold back because they're going to ghost you again. Because that's the truth. You're healing. But they want to communicate. That's the message. They want to send you a passionate message. Because they've hit a tower and been rejected for manipulating and now they're stuck they want to uh, balance to balance things out again they see you as the ten of cups the happy ever after the stability and they're waiting or you may have turned your back on this individual. That could be the advice on walk away, Cap. Stand your ground and protect yourself is the advice. 
they're still deceptive. Now, that would fall under the press three to schedule an appointment category. Cut them off. <laughs> oh, forgive me, Capricorn, but you know, that's the way I cope with pain. I'm like, I'm really tired of shedding tears, being unhappy, yada, yada. This person has not learned their lesson at all. To honor your sacred temple, body, mind, and soul. That's your advice. To listen to your ascendant masters, you're being guided. You already got the intuition on this person. Yeah, to maintain your peace. Keep the peace. Loving man being here and you're being guided. Um, the loving man is coming with flowers and female or male energy. Take it as it resonates. They come with flowers in hand smile on their face they're taking advantage let go letting go be optimistic about your future because I'm telling you right now you got a lot of pentacles and it's increasing a big increase it's a vast a vast universe and uh, you're going to be with great gratitude for these pentacles that are coming in financially you're rocking it and it's increasing and this person may sense it they may know it and they're looking at the long-term situation here capricorn and so if you are a returning hoe please press one and if you have a fake ass apology to make which it is please press two and please press three if you'd like to schedule an appointment. Otherwise, you can stay on the line and one of our agents would be happy to serve you today. I love you, Capricorn. I hope this makes you laugh today and encourage your spirit to uplift it. Take care, Capricorn.